Hey kittens! Silver here with Zoe the Deluxe Cat by Douglas Cuddle Toys and we have a new rather small diminutive little package here today. Um, so we're going to be adding a new kitty to the mix which uh, I did not expect to find actually. This particular cat was retired probably some years ago now um, and it doesn't come by very often so I was a little bit hesitant about it just because I know that the actual plush and the stock photo, photo differ pretty drastically, but I thought I would take a chance, give it a shot since I might not have another opportunity to see this cat in person. So I'm just going to open up this package and see how it goes. Okay, so we have the package open and it looks like the little guy is in another plastic wrapping of its own and wow this is a really really small cat um i was i was under the impression this would be uh, about 11 or so inches but it looks even smaller than that um but i do love tortoise cats um which is really what drew me to this plush to begin with um the coats on these cats are just so unique and vibrant and just so intricate to look at so let's take a look at this little this little tyke. If I can get her out. Alright, so let's see. So this is going to be the Russ Yomiko, I believe is how you pronounce it. A Yomiko Classics Tortoise Cat. So there she- Oh, she's very cute though. She's just little, that's all. There's nothing wrong with being small. Good things come in small packages, as they say. Um, so as far as the condition of the fur, it is a little bit more used than I was thinking, so it's going to take a good brushing. So this might be a little bit of a restoration project. Um, it's a cute face though. I, I do love the coat, the spotting, that sort of a reddish gingery color uh, that sort of predominates on this plush. And then you have the, blacks, uh, the black spots and then a little white belly and a little white around the collar here. And she has golden eyes, but I'm actually thinking about possibly doing an eye replacement on this one uh, because I have been after the Venus cat for a while, who's actually based on a real life cat. And um, that's actually a sort of a, a two faced looking cat um, because of her markings, but she also has uh, two different colored eyes. So I'm thinking possibly attempting a dual colored eye for this plush. Maybe we'll see. But um, the face is actually really, really cute. I'm very pleasantly surprised with the face. The uh, the angle was not very flattering that the eBay seller took this from. But um, the face is really sweet. And it has this nice little uh, plastic nose. It's got kind of a sort of a brown and darker brown coloring, sort of intermixed. And I even see little kind of little dots on the, on the nose to give it a little bit more realism. And the black muzzle. Now I think in the stock photo they show that the uh, the entire nose up uh, going upward is black, but as you can see it's really just this area here. And she's got this sort of little kind of like a sort of like a soft kind of cardboard tag in, on the front. I'm, I'm not exactly sure what that material is, but um, I know Yomiko Classics have that sort of same tag uh, right on the front. And she also has her hang tag, which is really nice. So I think after a good brushing, she's going to look a lot better. Here's her tush tag, the tortoise cat. So yeah, I'm actually quite excited to uh, to give this little plush a makeover. Um, we'll see what ends up happening, whether or not uh, we uh, do a little eye experimentation with this one. Uh, I'm thinking like it might really help her to stand out even more so. Um, but I really do love the coloring of the coat. It's you know that that's just what you want to see in a tortoise cat so um so yeah that's her and oh also the little black tipped uh, paws which are really cute as well and <laughs> just noticing that one little detail um so that is the Russ Yomiko tortoise cat um I would say it's probably about mm, maybe more like nine inches or so if even that maybe eight I I'm not sure I'd need a ruler to uh to ascertain that but um, but very, very cute. Uh, and I think that this little plush is going to uh, get quite a makeover by the time I'm done with her. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing my unboxing video. 
and I will be back again soon with some more plush goodness for you. Bye guys!